Hey YouTube, so this is a follow-up to the video where we turn down the CPU speed in order to stop stuttering in games. So the real thing that you should really do, like it's a temporary solution, but what you really need to do is update your BIOS. And one thing you have to be careful of is you don't want something called BitLocker enabled on your, your hard drive. If you have BitLocker enabled, it could cause all kinds of issues for you when you update your BIOS. You may not even be able to get into your copy of Windows. So that's something you really don't want to do. And the way you can tell if you have BitLocker enabled is to go to Settings and then go to Storage and then go to advanced storage settings disk and volumes and then you're going to look for you're going to look at these properties and you're going to see BitLocker right here and if it says that it's enabled or encrypted then you're going to want to make sure that you you uh, disable that somehow so mine says status not encrypted so I didn't have to worry but apparently you're going to have to do some research on Google and figure out how to turn off BitLocker if it does say that it's encrypted. Other, other than that, you're going to want to go uh, type the Windows key and R. And you're going to want to run msinfo32. And that's going to show you the information of your system. And it's going to tell you your BIOS. So mine is... Uh, Tough Gaming A520M plus Wi-Fi. This is what my BIOS name is right here. This is what I'm going to be looking up. So when you go to Google, you're going to search that, and you're going to go to the ASUS, if it's an ASUS board that you have, you're going to go to an ASUS, the ASUS uh, website, and you're going to download the, the BIOS. And it's going to kind of look like something I'll show you. We're going to go into, uh, uh, okay, let's see here. All right, so we're going to, you're going to put that onto a USB uh, stick. It's probably going to come like encrypt, uh, yeah, not encrypted, but um, zipped. So you're going to have to unzip that and extract it, and you're going to put that onto a USB stick. And this is what it's going to kind of look like. It's going to be like a cap file. And this is on my USB stick. And now when you go into the BIOS, there'll be an easy flash utility you're going to have to find. And uh, usually when you start your computer, restart your computer, you're going to hit delete to get into the BIOS. And you're going to use that easy flash utility and then pick the most recent version of uh, the BIOS file that you downloaded and put it on a, a USB stick. And then you're going to update your BIOS that way. And after you do this update, most BIOS manufacturers have fixed this issue with the stuttering in games. So that's really what you want to do. But a temporary fix is to turn down the speed of your CPU. But in the long run, you're going to want to update your BIOS. I hope that helped YouTube. And keep on gaming in the free world.